everyone. Like Nation, what is good? Ian, Vito, and Liz are back at you with another Tom McDonald reaction. What's going on, Hangover Gang? How y'all doing? Now y'all know we had to get the sheeple. Yeah, this this just came out yesterday, didn't it? Yes, it did. Yeah. Yes, it did. It happened to come out right before our recording day. So yeah. Hey, hey, it works yeah, out yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, for Perfect. real. Perfect. But, uh... You guys ready to just get into this? Oh, yeah. Dude. Definitely. Y'all, my mind might be a little, uh... Mushy. A little mushy. I've been, I was up to like 4 or 5 a.m. doing a case study for class this uh, last night. So. so so be kind to Ian if you make some sheeple Yeah, if, 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 <laughs> if I make, honestly, if Here I make go. something. You heard it? Bro, I, listen, <laughs> I've, been doing, thoughts, I've been doing references and shit. If I make a sheeple comment, man, <laughs> you know, take it easy on a brother today, all right? <laughs> you always. Like, damn. So, Always gotta say something. It's like, like, take it easy on a brother today, all right? But uh, let's. You know what? It's been a minute. Let's see what time's got. Let's, to let's see what we yeah. got to do here. Definitely. Humans been controlled since the day that they were civilized. The truth has been so heavily politicized. If you don't know who's controlling you and killing all the little guys, find out who you're not allowed to criticize. Black folks. Ooh. Ooh. Damn, we gonna start twelve second. We just, like you know. Find out who's trying to control you. Find out by who you're not allowed to criticize. Censorship. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's one of those. Okay. Okay. So obviously, the people who are trying to be in control are the ones that yeah. don't want you speaking. On, let me get my sweatshirt on. Get a little chilly down here. Oh God. Well, as you know, as Snoop said, it gets cold. You put your hood on. They're for, listen, man. Yeah. <laughs> listen. I didn't think it'd be this cold today. Look at the eye. We mean in the literal sense. No, not. Oh, well, yeah. The, you get a little, little one. jacket Tom, on. Tom, Tom's got a point there. All these people trying to block what you can and can't be said. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Why? Oh. Why are you trying to control a narrative? Mind. Why are you true, trying to only let true, true. That's fact, man. What, you know what, what are you saying? afraid of? Shit. 12 seconds in. He was, about, he was about to say something about black people, so now nah, I have to pay attention. You do. You do. <laughs> yes, <you're... laughs> when killing all the little guys, find out who you're not allowed to criticize. Black folks who were never, ever actual slaves. Fighting with white folks who ain't actual Nazis. Controlled by rich folks who hey. use the news to make hate. Got a point there. Yep. You know. So he made it. So clear. He actually yeah, makes no. a per. I haven't seen anybody actually put it in those types of terms. Mm -hmm. So, how do I sound less sheeple? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let me think this one out. All right. So, uh, I get what he means by that. Um, I remember during the uh, the protests and the in the riots, whatever you want to freaking call them, all the chaos that was happening throughout the country. I think it was like two last summer? Was, was George the summer Florida? of love, yeah. The was George Florida last summer? Was that summer? Uh, two, two summers ago? Was it, two, was it 2020 or 2021? I think it was 2020. I think it was 2020. 2020 okay. Damn, it's been two years. It's been so fucking long. Yeah, Damn. Yeah. Okay, um, so during that, I remember I was chilling, at, me and my dad were chilling at home. And this is when we were like, okay, these people don't know what the hell they're doing. There was a group of people there. They, they were, and, but I think they were young. I think it was my generation. There was a group of people. It was there was um, men, women, black, white, Hispanic. I, got, I saw all kind of diversity in it. But they were wherever Ulysses S. Grant statue was. I don't know where the hell it is. Oh, trying to rip it down. But they tore over the Ulysses S. Grant statue, and both me and my dad looked at each other and were like, "Do they not realize he was against slavery?" Mm -hmm. Like and they they just automatically assumed because he was white and at that and lived during that time period mm -hmm. that he was for slavery. But see, that's the problem. People, and he and he wasn't. No, he was he a hated. he was a like if you do your history, Ulysses S. Grant hated slavery. But see, if the kids in this country were actually taught the actual history, that, that's slavery included. It's, it's kind of like there were white people who marched with MLK. Yeah, not every white, not every person believed in slavery, especially. But he's right though. Not not a single black person living today in America. Unless you were born during that time and still alive. Magically. Please come forward and give us a secret. <laughs> like, but outside but, of that Unless you were born like outside of that. But um outside of some magical existing being. Yeah. 
who would have every right to be speaking about what slavery yeah. was actually like. I don't know how many people know about who Emmett Till was. There were white people who couldn't stand what happened to Emmett Till. So... People it's, have to understand that it's not just because you have a color of your skin that you automatically have a certain thought in your head. Yeah. yeah it's just because like, you think a certain way about a certain topic doesn't mean that's your way of thinking down the line. Don't get me wrong. I've seen I've, I've seen racial comments by black people. to Like, for some reason, dark-skinned black people don't like light skin. I've honestly seen more racism in between people of the same color than anywhere else. Like, don't get me wrong. I've never had a derogatory term called straight to my face. But that doesn't mean no one's ever called it to me behind my back. I can't do anything about that. And you know what the funniest thing is? I see. I seen an interview, a part where Waka said something. That was the funniest thing ever. He says, over here in America is where we only see yeah. the different colors. I saw that. Yep. And then when me and my boys, we went overseas. Yeah. We were white, Spanish, didn't matter. We, we were, were Puerto Rican. Everybody called us American. Yeah, American. It, it's crazy. Yeah. It's Nobody crazy. said that's the black American, that's the Puerto Rican For American, that's the Splash. <laughs> we were all... Like, I, I don't get what, for some reason, in, a, in, in America, like, and I'm sure it's not just in America, I'm sure it's in many other countries, but, like, I just don't get why you need to differentiate by skin color so much. Why, why do we have to be different here? Though? We're still all Americans. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, don't get me wrong, there is black culture. Like, yeah, of course. Act, like, they, like, but it's like, you don't have to, like... Has anyone ever heard of subculture? Yeah, like you don't have to separate all, separate everyone by like skin color. Like you don't got to do that. The most beautiful thing of this country is the blend of the cultures. Yeah. The mixture of all the cultures. Yeah. Not keeping everything separate. That's what. Yeah. That's the beauty of this country is bringing everything together, and being able to create something better. Yeah, and then the thing is, you learn by you learn the the cultures. And you see things, um, they might see things in a different perspective. Exactly. So, and we learn and we understand and we see the reason why. We learn so much from uh, from different cultures, you know? Look at the different types of fusion of food that has happened between. Yeah. When you see, like, Spanish culture and, and black culture. You when you see it, the you soul see. food and the Spanish food come together. Some of the combinations. Oh, um, you be yeah. Listen. What's the common? Food coma. Chinese food. <laughs> oh, so many Asian fusions. Yeah. Dude, a like, Spanish Asian fusion dish, dude, a soul food Asian. Yeah. Listen, it happens. Mm -hmm. It happens, man. Mm -hmm. And we're talking about it comes as a food, but it happens. At, it's the same thing with people. When you mix people together and you actually get to know each other, yeah, mm -hmm. I, I, and you get to see the greatness of the different types of culture, mm -hmm. and other cultures have bad aspects of them too. That's of almost any culture. Damn, we ain't even 30 seconds into this. Nah, it's just freaking time. Yeah. And you won't be bored either. Good lord, Jesus. <laughs> no, when you're learning about different like, things. Well, you're supposed to learn about culture yeah. and not think that somebody else's culture is better or worse oh, than no, yours. Oh, no, no, it's, it's not. It's just a different way of living. Exactly. Yeah. And you learn why people are too Some of y'all are too aggressive, with. man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Some of y'all are just too you aggressive. You can be proud of your culture. Yeah, exactly. but you don't gotta like... You don't gotta guard your culture. You're not superior than nobody else on exactly. the planet. You're exactly. Not, cut exactly. that superiority shit out. Nobody Stop is, guarding culture no, like you have no to protect it. No one is better it. than the other one. We like, all are unique. For real. We should be creating culture, not trying to protect mm -hmm. culture. And blending yeah. the cultures is creating exactly. more culture. Yeah. It's creating a beautiful thing. Because that's what America does. Yeah, I don't, I, I, I don't know how... It's like a big pie. You stir it all different. You know what? Why America's in a, a melting pot. And, and so, in the yeah, concept go, of the pot. show's no. foundation, okay, that's pretty black and white in understanding. Okay, I'm just going to say, like, I don't get how much more clear you can get in that. Yeah, we got fucking four minutes to get there. Good yeah. God. Fighting with white folks who ain't actual Nazis Controlled by rich folks who use the news to make hate While elite folks control other political parties It's a big lie, trying to make you pick sides Trying to make you burn the cities down and kill each other They got sick minds big Damn yep. That's why it's called the goddamn Uniparty <clears throat> Ain't there some new party getting made or something? Uh, there's more, there's actual, actual, liber not liberal, libertarian Yeah, has gotten, uh, they've gotten actual libertarian people have gotten control of it so it's not the liberals the liberal extension party anymore is what it used to be called good god essentially you got so many parties now man mm -hmm. it's hard to keep up but the problem is 
they have really next to them, they're not known. So they're probably still 10 years away from building. Because you have to gain seats at lower levels and build up. There's no way you can just blow into the scene. The problem is that's why we're dominated by two major parties. At the very top, unfortunately, at the highest levels, they're the same fucking thing. <laughs> Pretty much. I mean, all the money goes so, to those two. The problem is you have to start looking, especially if you're voting at the upcoming election, which you should get out and vote. Definitely, definitely should do that. Um, you should be voting for American values, people who love this country, not want to destroy your way of life and destroy this people country. People want to take care of this country. You should take look care at, of ourselves first before taking care of other countries. And please stop treating politicians like gods. Oh, definitely. Please, oh, God, Lord. No. I can't, I, that I can't take. Well, most of these all have to be voted out. That, that I, oh my God, I can't take it. Fortunately, we do need, like, politicians. We do need, uh, uh, because we need a, a how do you call it, a certain structure when it comes to See, deciding I, I what's care. the best for, for America. Exactly. I've seen another video of a guy saying it before. I have all the sympathy in the world for for immigrants who want to come to this country as long mm -hmm. as they do it the right way. Exactly. But yeah, why no should problem. we be giving a single dollar to an illegal immigrant who came here illegally when we have homeless people lining the streets? When and we have veterans who served this country, who put mm -hmm. their body and minds on the line and come back here are treated less than dirt. Why are, do we do have next to nothing for them? But we're rushing to help people who broke the law to be here. Now I got a question because I don't want to be like I don't have the fact with this. Do they check the backgrounds of the immigrants that are coming? <laughs> no. no, no, right? No. When you come here okay. the right way, yes. It's exactly. The and they're not checking. No. Yeah. So you know how much illegal shit is probably going on. <laughs> No. Extra stuff that we don't need. This country was on. this country was built on immigration, <clears throat> legal immigration. Mm -hmm. I know you guys have to say. Oh, I mean, I mean <laughs> it's just hard for me to talk about it because, like, anytime I, and it's not, and, and it's not, I'm not specifically saying this with uh, Vito and Liz, but when I t I've talked about immigration with like other people. And everyone always wants to say, like, oh, you just want to open board. I'm like, I didn't say that. I'm saying some of you, like, some people who talk about immigration, it's like the way you talk about it, it's like you're afraid of people from other countries. Mm -hmm. Don't, like, don't get me wrong. I feel like you got, like, you got to check people out. Make sure, like, all right, you're not, like, coming up with, over here, like, to, like, human trafficking and, like, and fuck shit, like, and, and mess crap or, up. Or escape from, from there. If you want it over there and you're escaping from over there, coming over here. We don't want other countries' criminals. Like, exactly. That's like my. That's I, my I just feel now. like. Did you see what Ecuador had just done? I think it was Ecuador. Ecuador or Honduras. I can't remember which one. They released all their prisoners. I didn't know that. Oh, why are they Because we have an open border right now. Poor real point. <laughs> Ah. There you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, so they come over here? Yeah. Continue your point. Yeah, continue. Sorry. Um, <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. How many of them come? I was <laughs> thinking about that. Uh, we're up to, I think we've had almost over 2 million people crossing the border this year. Oh, damn. I didn't know it was that high. <laughs> a, lot of, a lot of individuals. Yeah. Yeah. You know, may, you know, maybe uh those are people that have been released into this country that will maybe you know, maybe are. maybe Vito you know, when they get to America, maybe. Maybe they'll have a change of heart. Maybe the travel, the journey will reform their in, in, reform them and they'll self-reflect. And you know, <laughs> you're asking a lot. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, don't take me seriously, please, right now. Don't take me seriously. <laughs> if, if anybody <laughs> took him serious this, in that last 30 bro, seconds. Bro, it's a YouTube channel. We're not sitting up on some major news. Like, calm it down. Yeah. Calm it down, y'all, before y'all get upset. Dude, there's news. no way Ian thinks that criminals coming here is a good thing and they might change their mind. Like, if anybody took him seriously. I wish we should have been able to plan that out longer. Oh, God. Here we go. <laughs> you know the comments would have been really Oh, bad. here we go. Get to, oh, he won. No. 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 Oh, that's all right. People, like, you should have to check people out and make sure they, they stop the straight. Yes. That's why I mean, whenever we've ever talked about immigration, we want people to come to this Yeah, country. I got I don't the care where you way. come from. We want to make sure that you weren't a child molester, murderer, rapist. It's hard to forgive you. 
tax fraud. <laughs> it's, it's, it don't matter. It's, it's hard to forgive you. It's, I mean, we're not going to get every each and one of them, but the less, the better it is, mm-hmm. you know, because it's not going to be perfect. I it's mean, just do it the right way. Oh, uh, excuse me. It's hard to, you, you understand, with two million ask. people that came in, if only 1% of them are criminals, you know how many people that are? Oh God! Don't make me do math right now. It's when I get the bit. Two, so you said two two million to the one yeah. percent. Yeah. I want to say like a thousand or one like. It's like two thousand. Two thousand. Okay, so it wasn't far. Uh, math's not my strong suit, guys. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, what if just if just one percent of that is murderers? I mean, I guess that's why you need police officers. <laughs> that's, why. You see, that's still yeah. <laughs> two hundred murderers that would be that would be loose in this country right now. Mm-hmm. Huh? You know how fast? Kind of, kind of difficult. Yeah, yeah, do, you, do you understand how quickly this kinda, can be put into perception? Yeah, kind of you know, you know how of... fast the criminals that already exist in in the United States that will go ahead and take in the other criminals that are coming in that don't have no identification, nothing, like if they don't exist. And they could just send them out and do what they want them to do. Oh, you're talking do. about like collaborating? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Oh, okay. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Like working together because that uh-huh. sort of person does not have no identification. Now, There's nothing. Now, I would 100% understand the struggling family that is trying to be- get a better life. Completely understand that. But then I also do understand there's like there's there's struggling families here to like I, I exactly get, I, I get it exactly. Get it. Mm-hmm. We gotta take care of this I, country first. I think when it comes to like having the discussing about uh, discussion about immigration, don't I'm not saying all people do them. I'm, I'm just saying it feels like a lot of people like. Don't be afraid of someone just because they came from another country mm-hmm. or like they're like. You see, Ian, I think a lot of people automatically assume that they're afraid of people coming from another country when that's not it at all. The problem, what I, what we just were talking about, is what most this is just sca- my opinion. I think that I, I would be scared right now because they're coming in illegally. Mm-hmm. But if those people coming in the right way, I would not be scared. If at there all. was two million immigrants that came here legally last year, you know. Ecstatic that would make me. That would be awesome. If there was two million people yeah. that came through the system and got processed and are now citizens that want to be citizens of this country. That don't, would be amazing. Don't get me wrong, I think there's damn sure a better way to handle immigration. Oh, I don't got they, the answers to it. Nobody don't does. don't nobody ask does. me the answers. Don't ask me to quote nothing. I don't have the but it's like but just, clearly But just letting people walk in is not something good. has exactly. to be done to fix the system. Exactly. That's just like clearly something's gotta be done. Mm-hmm. But but now I think we should start the song over because yeah, yeah, we okay, yeah, we don't. Get, <laughs> yes, guys, we're, we're gonna shit. start it over. We're going on a video. Twenty-eight okay. seconds. We made it twenty-eight yeah. seconds. Can we beat that? Okay, here we go. Holy shit! <laughs> Humans been controlled since the day that they were civilized. The truth has been so heavily politicized. If you don't know who's controlling you and killing all the little guys, find out who you're not allowed to criticize. Black folks who were never ever actual slaves, fighting with white folks who ain't actual Nazis. Controlled by rich folks who use the news to make hate, while elite folks control all the political parties. It's a big lie, trying to make you pick sides, trying to make you burn the cities down and kill each other. They got sick minds, big lies, deep on the police so that there's big crime. To take away our freedom, to restore order, they let die. Play with people, turn men into women. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm. Yep. Mm-hmm. I like his directiveness yep, in this one. I do. Because he's right. One thing... See, the thing that I don't like... like don't get me wrong. Hey, we made it to 30, 30 seconds. seconds! Oh, we made it! <laughs> 30 seconds. I, I got to give that to Tom. I like when he, in his songs, like when he like when he's trying to like talk about a problem, mm-hmm. it's not like he's not subliminally talking. No, about it. it's he goes, just he goes like right at direct. Yeah, so I like that. He does. To take away our freedom to restore order, they let. And to be fair, I think he's going even more directly at it ever since Chris Webby has said, "I say things that Chris that Ty even." Shut Ty up! Was. I was just gonna say that. Yeah, no. No, no, no. Just remember in Raw Thoughts 5, but that was one of Chris Webby's lines. Yeah. I say shit that even Tom McDonald wouldn't, won. wouldn't say. Yeah. And I was just Ever since then, that. he's been going even more direct yeah. and at even harder issues. 
I mean, what Chris Webby, he is more explicit. Oh, yes. The kids. The, I, w- I the, would say Chris Webby is kids, less filtered. Oh, he is. The kids, he is. Kids, but I'm saying he's been less too filtered young to, since. The kids are too young to I see what you're saying. To, but kids could actually. That, that's what I'm getting at. Could listen. Tom has actually gone closer to the sun. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You know I what see, I mean? I see what you're saying. Chris Webby's running right into it. Yeah, he does. Tom's now not a... When not that he raw, was before. He's raw. But I think he was <laughs> like... Raw. Right, maybe he he's eased right. into it. Maybe you're right. He danced around issues. He danced and then Chris just went, okay, I see what you're saying. Now he's like, all right, maybe Chris is right. I got to go right into it. And now Tom is like, woohoo! Diving into <laughs> yeah. it. Okay, okay. Not that he wasn't before Hangover Gang. Not before yeah, I, see, always I, 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 I see what you mean. We, we know Tom Stay was not afraid. Stay out of my head, please. I see what, I see what Stay you mean. Stay out of my head. Because <laughs> I was just going to say that. <laughs> oh. I mean, I'd be all for it to see them do something together. That would be nice. That would be nice. Or, yeah. but you know how explicit that would be too. Friendly competition to see who can do the more directive song. Ooh, that would be good. Ooh. Who's yeah. who's better at analyzing the shit, Tom or yeah. Chris? Well, maybe that's what Tom's doing. Yeah. Fair enough. Technically, he is going more at it. So maybe he is trying to do. Fair enough. I, I, I'm all good with a little friendly competition. Not that, we, not that we're saying it is. No, yeah, yeah. No, but Chris Webby is more explicit. There's more uh, swearing in it. There's more of that. Than, you know, the kids. Well, on YouTube, Tom always him. has it bleeped out. Yeah. It's always bleeped out. Even if you go. You but if you, if you download the track, it's not it's not bleeped out. Oh, yeah. There's, yeah oh, there's, okay. Tom actually, yeah. he swears more than you realize. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, yeah. It's, yeah it's just. I more, always he does, he it, does it so his video will stay me. up on, right. on yeah. YouTube. He does it so he can monetize it more on YouTube. And it yeah. makes perfect sense. Trust me. Makes Business sense. wise, that's smart. Yes. Yeah. But it would be nice to see that. But maybe that it'd be interesting to see what Webby does next. Yeah. Webby yeah. I, I, because I'm all for it. He's actually talking about the yeah, elite. That, elites. You know, I, mean? I like healthy competition. But see, he talks about the elites. Webby would say Epstein. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I see what you, I see what you're it's saying. Way more direct that's with what it. I get. That's what. Yeah. That's not all we're talking about. Hang on, we get. I see what you're saying. Webby says it. So, so it's goes like around it almost. it's like yeah. okay, one mentions just the general system. See, the next person will name drop. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. He's y- you know what Tom? So you know what Tom's you talking he's, about? He's, yeah. It's just like Eminem. Webby says it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just like Eminem. It's like M. And M will name he, if, if M has a problem yeah. with you, he oh, name drops your ass. He don't give a shit. Right. Anymore. That's yeah. all we're saying. Tom still goes at it, but not but, direct. I see. What you're, now, I, now you see I, what I'm I saying. See, I, okay. Yeah. Now okay. he's going like more directly. The, the compare and contrast makes sense now. Okay. That, 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 that's what we're. That's getting. fair. That's, that's what fair. We're that's fair, Vito. Make lies deep on the police so that there's big crime to take away our freedom to restore order. They let die. Play with people. Turn men into women. Make the counterculture mainstream. See, mix up the- he keeps saying they, them. They, I, 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 I see what you mean. I'm just thinking I, robot. Mm-hmm. Yeah, me too. <laughs> like, no, I'm just thinking, where's Will see, Smith at? <laughs> yeah. See, through the entire thing, Webby was saying Pelosi. Yeah, he was yeah. Saying, I, right, he was uh, saying yeah, he was actually saying saying that. Ted Cruz. Yeah, he na- he talks about the he, people. He actually yeah. named okay. Whether it's Democrat, Republican, I see what he you don't mean. give a shit. I see. <laughs> I, fair. I mean, to be fair, Tom's saying they're all the same. Saying, yeah, he's pretty much saying what does it matter? They're all the same type of entity. But he's not like I got yeah. You see what I mean? Yeah, you can yeah. See, no, you, yeah, we get it. Yeah, I, 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 that, I that's like where it. Webby's saying I say stuff that even Tom McDonald won't. Yeah. It's not that everyone keeps saying he was dissing Tom. No, no, no. no. He no, wasn't no, dissing Tom. I don't Tom. think he was he dissing was Tom. Dissing it's what he was saying. All. I say the stuff that even Tom McDonald won't. Tom's not name dropping. I no mean, more. but if either one of them feel that type, well, let's see that. That's, that's put it on the mic. You know see, what I'm saying? But see, that would only be if Webby felt somewhere. I don't that's true. I don't think Webby feels that. I don't think so because he would have. I yeah. think Webby's just saying, yes, Tom is... probably a little bit more speculated. Well, probably. Yeah. Because we- I, technically Tom has actually got a bigger reach. Which I guess to show you that Webby's been rapping a lot longer. Chris Webby actually listens to Tom's music. See, yeah. Webby's reach is, I think, more to like the actual hip-hop nation. You know, like more people. Yeah. Tom is more, obviously, Hangover Gang, you guys, obviously we know hip-hop. I'm not saying Chris that. Webby's been in the game a long time. That's though. just what I'm getting at. He's got more like hip-hop yeah. heads. Hip-hop heads. Tom is still. Tom has got a lot, a lot of that fanfare because of YouTube jumped on. Yeah, very good at what he does, but he doesn't. He's got a lot of that. Like, I want to say probably the fourteen to thirty-two year old range is his main. When, fan. when I think he's of, got a lot of the older fans. When I'm I think of Chris wrong. Webby, I think of more underground. Right. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, what I'm getting. Yeah, at. Yeah. 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 Definitely. And I think of a little more like honestly, he Tom is like saying "f you" to the mainstream, but he's mainstream. Yeah. 
Both artists got weight to their name. My, my point is, if you go, if you're walking through a certain anywhere, you say Tom McDonald, more people, or Chris Webby, more people would be like, oh, I know who Tom is. Chris who? Unfortunately, because Webby's music is awesome. I think it, I, it, true. It I I Chris Chris Webby is more for the independent. But that's person. also because Tom has been on Fox News. He's been, yeah. the, he's been more. Chris uh, Webby don't do that shit. Exactly. Yeah, he just, Chris Webby's more about the music. Yeah, yeah. He got something to say, he says it on the mic. Yeah, yeah, I see what you mean. That's just what we're getting at. Tom is more in your face about stuff. He's he's more opinionated. Mm -hmm. He's more with his fans on Instagram and stuff. Fair enough. I'm sure Webby is too. I never yeah. have Instagram. I really, that's just not me. It is, uh, but I, I, yeah. I know because you see the Tom all over YouTube. He gets yeah. all over stuff. You don't see Webby as much doing all that. He puts his music up. Stuff. Yeah, puts his music up, does his concerts, and minds his business. Mm -hmm. he, he's the old, he's old school. Yeah, ain't yeah. nothing wrong with that. Webby's old no, school. He's a '90s old school rapper. He's not. It's not wrong with that. Yeah. Nothing wrong That's with just that where his head's at, at all. That. Right. Tom is the is a is the more Webby online version where yeah. you can. He's been able to use YouTube and stuff to be able to blow himself up. Better Tom's than like guys in that. Tom's more business sense. They're both are, way better business sense. They, yeah, they both he is, are, he's are more business oriented. Webby just likes to rap. They're both right. are reaching out to their audience, and I mean, I bet Webby both. wish he knows more than he back then than he does now. Yeah. Yo. Oh, yeah. If he knew what he knew then that he knows now, shit, Webby if I knew what I knew at eighteen that I know now, shit. Sorry, let me interrupt you, man. <laughs> so, so shit. Do you want me to back it up? Yeah, we should um, uh, we should start the song over again. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'll, I'll back up from right here. From the eye. From the eye. While well, elite folks control other political parties, it's a big lie. Trying to make you pick sides. Trying to make you burn the cities down and kill each other. They got sick minds. Big lies. Keep on the police so that there's big crime. To take away our freedom, to restore order, they let die. Play with people. Turn men into women. Make the counterculture mainstream. I mean? Until we need them to restore the order, they let die. Mmm. Okay. So pretty much restore the order they want. No. No, no, no. It's like to make us think we need them yeah. to restore the, the order. Oh, okay, I get it now. That they making kill. making people yeah, dependent. Exactly. Exactly. Sheeple. Yeah. yeah. It, it, it's the dependent. Making mindset. you think, oh, we can't do this without them. We yeah. need them. Nah, bro. Oh hell no. It, it was fine. I'm just you. waiting for Will Smith. It was fine before you screwed it up. Oh, you wait? Oh, I'm yeah. just waiting for my man Will Smith. Tom, did you get him for the video? Right that here. would be insane. <laughs> I'm right here. Will just is like. <laughs> Will would probably try to smack him. <laughs> oh! Oh! Yes! Oh, Will. Yes! They're not going to let Will win that. Yes. No, never. Why, why the fuck he did that? Like that? Nah, but that I'm sorry. Chris stupid. Rock deserved to be slapped a little bit. You can't tell no. me you didn't know Jada had that problem. I, I get it. No, I, I he's a comedian. No, no, no. But what I'm saying about what I'm I, saying I understand about it. Is, but if you're not allowed to make fun of somebody as a comedian, you can't make fun of anybody for anything. No, no. I, I'm agreeing with the comedian part. I think, like, I think because no, 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 no. further information came out after, like, he had been shit talking Will behind the scenes. So okay, so how, how should I play? So why was Will laughing before he looked at his wife and then he went? went no, Will Will laughed until he saw the eye roll, and exactly. then he knew if I didn't say anything, so, don't do anything. I don't really I'm in believe. Trouble I don't really him. believe the shit talking behind the scenes, because he's doing. He's sitting on stage laughing at what Chris Rock is saying. Fair enough. And fair then enough. when he looks yeah, at Jerry, fair. yeah, I've watched that video so many times, and I saw that he was laughing. And as soon as he turned, turned the she, eye roll, she was. Where her posture and whatever, she like rolled her, her eyes. Oh, and, and then true. that's why he had to get up that's and do true. something about it. That's but that true. wasn't that wasn't the way to do it. You you oh, don't go and God, slap that's, him. That's, that's so, just my opinion. I, I don't believe that, that, that Chris Rock shit talking behind the scenes. Don't get me wrong. The shit was entertaining. Oh, it, oh definitely was. <laughs> I thought the shit was funny. Definitely Boy. was. But. Uh, fair enough. Fair enough. Especially for a guy that's been in comedy for as long as he has. Been. Fair, fair, fair. You don't, fair get, enough. you don't get to go strike a comedian fair, for, for making fair enough. for cracking I, a joke at your wife losing her hair. God. Fair enough. Fair enough. Now, if it would have been, uh, and then he was saying G.I. Jane, I would have been like that. Actually, would have technically would have been a compliment. That would have been a compliment because G.I. Jane, she was a fucking strong, strong woman. Oh, God, she was a strong right. woman. She stood there enough. until. <laughs> Until she yeah, has to fucking ring that fucking bell. <laughs> <laughs> we 
she I would have taken that fucking. I would have oh, been God. okay. Now, we got Thank Liz you. hyped now. We got, we got Liz hyped. I'm done. <laughs> She's on moonshine, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> hey, hey, don't give up a secret. <laughs> but you, you see what I mean? Fair, fair enough. Honestly, if it would have been somebody who was never known for comedy and then had said that. Like it was a, it was an actor trying to be funny. It's like, dude, that you're not it's funny. Like, it's That's, like, who are you? Right, dude. dude. <laughs> but fair enough. It's Chris Rock. Fair, fair enough. Fair enough. I think we can all just say it was. We were shocked by it. it we was, were all shocked. We were it. entertained by the shock of it. He could have just went up to him and be like, "Don't talk about my he wife like that or something." Like, him, like keep you. Yep. What he said, keep you. <laughs> But anyway, let's, let's, let's get back I'm to the song. Right. Right. I said, guys, guys, we will sorry. actually I'm restart sorry. the song in this one because we went on a little tangent. Re restart. I'm sorry. Okay, okay, good, good. It was third, third time's the charm, everybody. Okay. <laughs> Everyone's like, I came for goddamn reaction. <laughs> no more, no more tangents again, on this one. Sorry. And again, if you guys haven't watched this video, go don't watch don't it. watch go, the song go, the go first watch time. Oh, go watch. Uh, my bad, my bad, my bad. <laughs> I can't with them right now. Yeah. Go watch it first and then come watch our reaction. Th yes. This is our reaction. Mm -hmm. Yes. We are going to do so many. We're going to pause. We're going to yeah. talk pause about a lot. We're going to pause a lot. We're gonna, he, he's <laughs> going he's gonna to say something that we're going to talk slightly about and it's going to trigger something about come something else. Yeah. So, yeah. Like reaction, guys. Yeah. So Don't, it's a reaction slash discussion. And for all, and for all the people that tell us we script these and do it beforehand. <laughs> Bro, yeah. This ain't script. Yeah, nah. yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. No. Oh, no. Humans okay. been controlled Third time's the charm. They were Third? Civilized. The truth has been so heavily politicized. If you don't know who's controlling Sorry. you and killing all the little guys, find out who you're not allowed to criticize. Black folks who were never, ever actual slaves. Fighting with white folks who ain't actual Nazis. Controlled by rich folks who use the news to make hate. While elite folks control other political parties. Mm. It's a big lie. Trying to make you pick sides. Trying to make you burn the cities down and kill each other. They got sick minds. Big lies. Deep on the police so that there's big crime. To take away our freedom to restore order they let die. Play with people. Turn men into women. Make the counter culture mainstream to mix up the system change Ugh. the pronouns of gender is a spectrum so is privilege i know poor white folks and black celebrities with millions yep yep 44 seconds <laughs> hmm. so nah you, you know what no, no. remember we we didn't see don't waste this veto no <laughs> oh, don't, don't, don't yeah, waste. She, Vito, no you should be filthy rich. Don't don't waste this. Don't waste your whiteness. Right? Don't, don't waste. Don't Vito. waste it. Don't you waste this. You understand? <laughs> put put this Dude. to you. Don't need this and this, Vito. All put you this need, to use. All you need is your skin <laughs> skin color. That's <laughs> Make sure every day, Vito. Put this to you. Yo, people gotta wear visors because you're so fucking blind. <laughs> you're too bright. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, <laughs> oh, that was a, I, I had just, to. just wasted away with that. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> but he's got a point there. No, for real, for real, on some real stuff though. On, on, some, on some real stuff. Mm -hmm. there's, Damn, there's plenty, of, plenty of poor, poor white people. Oh, j j listen, man. There's, there's actually more poor white people in this country than poor black people and Spanish people. I don't like to see anybody poor. I just want to nah, say that I don't like, to, like, like it sucks. Do, do, you know? But do you understand, pe people, do you, do you understand Excuse me. that if the average person was a millionaire, the person that's making $100,000 a year would be considered poor? That's true. You have to understand that <clears throat> there are tons of people that want to work hard, and then yeah. there's the ones that don't. Mm -hmm. Everybody's different. So there's going to be people out there that are going to be actually chasing what they want, what they want to do with their careers. There's going to be people that they settle because they feel comfortable mm -hmm. with being the janitor. Well, there's some people that want to be a boss, and you know? there's some people that want to work for a boss. Yeah. I do think not everyone can be a leader. That's what I'm getting at right there. And it, and it, it doesn't make you less significant of a person. Some people just don't got leadership quality in them. Exactly. See, well, I've always, Some people just don't got it. But see no. that, and that right there is why everybody should have the same starting point, but not everybody can have the same outcome. Yeah, that's why. Like, there is I'm, no such thing as equity of that, outcome. That, that's why I'm kind of getting done with the whole everybody's a king or a queen. Not everyone can be a king, dude. No, 
Not everyone. No. Not everyone has what it takes. Because guess what? No. Somebody there's always that somebody wants to be a jester. Yeah, like, like some somebody not sometimes somebody wants just to, wants to be an employee. Not everybody yep. wants they don't the want to deal thing. with the stress of leadership. Exactly. And there's nothing wrong with that. Some people don't want the pressure. Some people thrive for the pressure. Pressure, yeah. And some mm -hmm. people just don't want it. And I and I don't I don't <clears> fault <throat> anybody who don't want to deal with that. I don't fault it. See, everybody is most people get mad at the rich and the people who have the money. But guess what? A lot of the times, they're the ones that worked hard. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying all of them. Some people no. were handed it to them at birth. But yeah. guess what? Exactly. Somebody down the line in their family started with nothing. At one exactly. point, Worked there was a so member hard. in that family that had nothing. Yeah. That was poor. That's right. Yeah, worked so hard That's to fair. get there. For any family to be considered an elite family, there was eventually a person in that family that had nothing. And said, enough. And set their family up for generations. So we need to stop bitching about what we don't have and start working for what you want. And mm -hmm. stop expecting it to be handed to you. Because mm -hmm. if you want something, you got to go earn it. you got to put the work in. Yeah, and you give dirty looks to, to people that have money. First of all, you don't know their background. Okay? You don't know how hard they work for their money. Or you don't know if they just would... They were born with the money. You know, you just can't assume that all oh, rich people are like not not bad. I'm not trying to say bad. <laughs> I'm trying to find the right Liz's word. Trying to be nicer. I'm trying to find the right word. You can't word. assume that every rich person you come across is gonna look down on you. And th there you go. Yeah. He explained it. Because guess what? Like. Some of them, some people knew exactly what, what it's, it's like, like to be where you were. Exactly. Or where you are. Yep. Now, if you got people who forget where they come from, then uh -huh. that's just a broken character. Exactly. That's just the person that you don't need to be associated with yeah. and you don't need to do business with. I would never want to do business with somebody that looks down on me. I wouldn't want nah, somebody yeah. to help me get ahead in life that's going to look down on me. I want to earn what I have. I want to know that when I got, get somewhere or we get something, that we earned it. Yeah. And, Fair enough. And the thing is, if you lose all of that, then you know how to do it again. Exactly. You know how to get on top of it. If anything ever gets taken from us, we know exactly how to rebuild it. If and do a it again, spoiled person loses everything, they're not going to know how to get on top. They're going to be in the corner and worry about it. So. See, if, if this channel blows up and makes it, I'm going to know I did it and Ian did it and you yeah. did it because we worked to put the work in. It's not because I was white, it's not because you were brown, and it's not because you were black. It's because we're putting the work in. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're here recording videos for you guys to watch and enjoy, busting our asses and doing it. We're not doing this because we're making tons of money. <laughs> we don't make a dime off of this. Uh, I, I, I enjoy. I just we enjoy doing videos. Yeah. We enjoy, we enjoy doing, communicating yeah, and, and we, talking with y'all. Yeah, we like to share information and just get our opinions out there. See right. our perspective of things. You know. Let's try to get half. Yeah, push, 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 push. <laughs> oh, it. Everyone's like. I just want to see it. Goddamn sucks! <laughs> but like they start earlier. with a lack of information and only give you facts to a branded corporation. <laughs> God damn. Tom, stop! I'm <laughs> trying to get at least one minute in, man. He's right, though. They control and they flow of information. Mm -hmm. Tom, this is why I take us, like, this is why every video we do is like a 50 minute reaction because you gotta have something every line. Yep. Like, you. Bruh. Yeah, every line is a point. Like, Bruh. It has a point. We, can, we haven't even gotten a minute into this damn thing. We shouldn't be having people at the top being able to dictate to us what's true. Because how do they know it's true? Oh, what gets me, don't tell me how to live my life. Exactly. I live, I'll do, bro, don't, that's the one thing that irks me. Don't tell me how to live my life. Don't tell me what to believe in. Don't tell me that I'm, I'm, an I, What's an outcast? I, I, there we go, an outcast. Because I don't believe every single freaking thing that you... If I have a difference of opinion and you don't like it, don't talk to me. Exactly. If it's that much of an issue for you, bye. To the, bye. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't... I'm not going to waste my, like... I'm not... I'm, I'm. That's the part I'm done with. If you can't have a sensible conversation, if we're going to start talking about something and you're going to get angry and start that, be, we, Bro, don't, we don't need to talk. That yeah, you can get heated. I'm talking about getting physically yeah. angry where you want to throw down. Yeah, like no, 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 no. We don't need to throw down because of a topic. If if you if you're threatening violence on someone because they have a different opinion, they're, they're not the problem. It's you. 
If you are threatening someone because they think differently, then rethink your life. Yeah. Which is why you should be allowed to see all the information. Like, good. Once God. you allow people to start dictating what is true and what's not, then you start getting people lined up behind certain topics. And you, no, yeah. no, 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 no. And y'all got to stop conforming to what people want. Stop with the conforming. Start using your own mind. And yeah, start stop, doing... stop conforming. I mean, we got to the point where we were censoring doctors. Like, dude. Actual dude. scientists because they didn't believe the same outcome that other scientists came to. How the hell do we know what, what the actual science is true? The whole point of science is exploratory. To figure out different things and to disprove what you just proved. That's science. There is no actual truth in science. The whole I mean, point of science is to disprove what you just figured it, out. Science changes every freaking day, dude. Exactly. There's new discoveries of shit every freaking day because mm -hmm. there's new variables to things. It's not that hard to understand. Distort your worldview with an algorithm that changes based on propaganda curated for your engagement. We can't be free. Oh, we made it. Made it to the hook. We made it to the hook. Yeah. <laughs> no, still we're on the same team, but you're the sheep. That's it right there. What are you just saying, hook? We're all on the same team. We're yeah. all Team America. Yeah, y'all, y'all tripping though. Why would anybody want this country burned down and started over? Nah, we. Nah. We have people from all over the world killing themselves to try to get here, but we're gonna burn it down and start anew. I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Did we make mistakes in the past? Yeah. Tell me a country that didn't. Of course. Show me one country that's been perfect all the way through that never changed and redid their. In order, process. in order to to make something better, you have to make a mistake. Well, not you, but. But going back to ground zero, no, 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 no. You don't go back to the beginning. No, board. exactly. You know what didn't exactly. work, so why would you want to repeat it? Exactly. That's what I was trying to why, say. Why are we going backwards? You make. You try to make things better. You don't. Nah. <laughs> Fucking. You learn from the mistakes and you make things better. Yes. That's all. <laughs> Tom, you, you're awesome, dude. You're not you're good. The machine, I noticed something. Um, this man always spits the hardest when he got the bulletproof vest yep. on. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Yo. But he's right. You're all sheeple. Nope. What do you actually believe? That's, you know what? That's that 50 cent inspiration. Oh. Yeah. 50 old would. Yo. Oh, 50 would always be hardest when he was with, when he yeah, had the bulletproof I, vest yeah, on. I bet you that was. So Dude, cool. I'm trying to tell you. Tom is always as hard when he got the vest on, man. Because that's what people are going to want to hit him for. Yeah. yeah that's the... That's, uh, yeah. He knows that he's saying stuff where people are going to want to hit him Look at Vito out here. Look at me. Yeah. <laughs> Hollywood been writing your brain, controlling your mouth. You say lit, fleet, bet, cap. They trying to dumb you down. They endorse whatever narrative is popular to shout. And use minorities in movies for diversity clout. Two sides on the spectrum, but yeah. ain't none of them honest. Took the red pill. Yep. 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 How many shows and things right now oh, God. are trying to jump on that minority clout train? Oh, man. No. <laughs> oh, God. Every line, Tom. No, God damn. I saw yeah. this video. on. There was this girl on TikTok, this white woman on TikTok. She was walking around her backyard making the video. And she's like, can someone please, like, she's like, I'm from the South, okay? I'm as country as it gets. But can you please explain to me, like, how some of y'all racist people are going to ride around and talk about and be derogatory towards people of color, but then you're going to blast Jay-Z in your truck? Like, it don't make sense to me, man. <laughs> she's oh. like, explain it to me, bro. Or eat Chinese food. Yep. Yeah, like, I don't get or that. Spanish food. Yep. Like, I don't get that. I don't get it. How you gonna be, you, you, you don't, like, how you do that? How, how you know they're actually racist? Just because they're riding down with a uh, Confederate flag? I don't know. You know I'm what I mean? Like, I, you know what I mean? Yeah. Fair enough. Quick, being down in the South, just because you see a white person rolling around with a Confederate flag don't mean they're racist. It means something different to them down there. <laughs> I, mm -hmm. you, bro, you can... See, what people don't have to... Just because a symbol means something to you doesn't mean that's what the symbol means to the entire world. 
Who explains it better? Up church. Up church explains it the best. He explains but, it the best. But you best. see what I mean? You know, it's the same thing with like the cross. And unfortunately, it's the same way with the swastika. To some people, that's unfortunately a, the sign just the, the symbol got perverted. It did. I mean, Black Lives Matter got perverted. Mm -hmm. It got it got hijacked. The pentagram, the pentagram. dude. The freaking pentagram. Is the pentagram the Jewish one? Is that the Jewish? No, one? the devil symbol. What was it originally? A pagan symbol. Oh, I'm thinking the Star of David shit. Yeah, the Star oh, of David bad. is the Jewish. Well, the, well, the pentagram David. it has a goat on mm -hmm. on it. Which is yeah. a, uh, a Satanist. It got taken to the Satanism, but yeah. it was originally a pagan symbol. Yeah. It got perverted into Satanism. So then now they think that it's evil and, right. you know, we do sex. Yes. We do. You hear me? That yeah. We do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're not uh, secret Satanists. Uh, no. We're not. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah. Doesn't float my no, boat. No, no, no. Nah, doesn't, doesn't really float my boat. Ian's been to our house. He, he knows. Yeah, we don't do <laughs> Don't go. <laughs> <laughs> Enter at your own risk. <laughs> hey, it's October. Halloween. Just, and, that's why well, I said Enter at your own risk. Yeah. yeah. I think that's why I said it that way. Movies for diversity clout. Two sides on the spectrum, but ain't none of them honest. Took the red pill and the blue pill, spit them both in the garbage. Being woke used to mean you understood you're a target. And now it's having two good legs and never taking a step forward. If you Ooh. agree it's free speech, this way it's hate speech. I didn't get that part. Ooh. What did he say? Being woke used to be remember that you're not... Back it up. Bill spit them both yeah. in the garbage. Yeah, Being no, woke used to mean you understood you're a target. And now it's having two yeah. good legs and never taking a step forward. Yep. Oh, the two legs. Mm. No, that's the part that I ain't here. The Take, two legs. Yeah. Now it's mm. having two good legs but not being able to take a step forward. Yep, I get that. Being woke means all you do is you live in the past. Mm -hmm. You don't have any way to go forward. You're trying to make up for everything that happened before. You can't make up this what happened before. This is crazy, bro. Especially when you had nothing to do with it. Tom, you're pushing an hour right now, man. You got, you, got, you got, shit. He's making us work today. Nah, for real. He's if right, you, though. You're not here. It's free speech. Disagree, it's hate speech. Erase it if it came from anywhere except the mainstream. Trump supporters labeled as the racist, but they right can't here. be. Lincoln was Republican, and that's who ended slavery. <sighs> yep. Can, can, can you rewind that again? <laughs> I, 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 I got you. I, I, I knew that was going. Was he white? Was Lincoln white? I, 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 think, I think Lincoln was a white guy. I think he was white, right? Was he white? I think he was white. Was, was he white, Ian? I can't remember. <laughs> you know. You would just need to you know. freaking Always wore a black top hat, you know. Yeah, you know. Last time I checked, Lincoln was white. Unless some things have changed. He did, he did have the black and, beard. He had a big and, black beard. Unless, listen, and, unless and, some variables have changed. And he died for his beliefs. <laughs> I was trying to, oh, took forever to take that out. Like, you know, <laughs> last time I checked, <laughs> it's a little bit more on the Caucasian side of things, you know. He's like Martin Luther King, he died for his beliefs. Like, it's free speech. Disagree, it's hate speech. Erase it if it came from anywhere except the mainstream. Trump supporters labeled as the racist, but they can't be. Lincoln was Republican, and that's who ended slavery. Science been politicized, it's easy to see. A mask became a symbol of which side you believe, but you'll never... See what everything that he was saying... Good was God. Insane. Tom! Canceled if you disagree. Tom, you got... Tom, this is going on an hour, dude. We still, we still have another two minutes. Two Good minutes. Lord, dude. Yeah, we have two more minutes. Yeah. <laughs> we got to get to the second hook. <laughs> he's, oh, he's, oh, my he's speaking so much truth. Nah, dude. Yeah, it's, 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 it's crazy. It's, it's, this shit is wild. Because every single line, he's like talking to people. Yeah, and yeah. honestly, more liberals are going to hate everything that he's saying. And more people towards the right are going to be liking what he says. People center leaning right 
and aunt are going to be agreeing with him. People that are more left are going to be attacking him. I can tell you right now, I'm tired of this whole shit left, right, Democrat. Oh, it's bullshit. I'm, oh, yeah, I'm no. tired, I'm just, dude. I'm just saying how the demographic is going to line up yeah, behind this song. I'm, if you went up on Twitter and looked at it, I bet you liberals bro, and leftists are attacking this like crazy. Bro, no, this, you know what I'm tired that's of? That's one thing y'all got to stop with that crap. No, yep. you know what I'm tired of? is people that cannot be civil for, for what they, their beliefs is if there is different it's like oh my god it's like a war now against each other it's, it's like a civil war but the, but the problem is about 70 percent of it is on the left side they get angry and don't even want to communicate with somebody on exactly the right. they want to attack yeah, no, and you're get Republican. angry no or or you you're you're not a democrat no i don't want to deal with don't you don't get me no, wrong there's no. republicans that they do it too but no. it's more often than not you'll find a republican that's more willing to sit down and talk to a liberal than the other way around. Mm-hmm. I'm just Ian, man. I mean, can, just Ian. can you give me an example where, I, can you tell me I'm wrong? I mean, this is America. You're supposed to be <sighs> united no matter which side you're on or if you're in the middle of it. You know what I'm saying? How hard is that to understand that? Ian, guys like Ben Shapiro will sit down with anybody, but Hassan Piker won't. Tim Cass. Tim Poole. Uh, Hassan oh, Tim Piker Poole is a young Cass. Turk. He's uh, pretty famous on the left. Pretty famous leftist. So, um, I'll, I'll give it up to Vosh. He's one of the only ones that on the left that actually will talk to people on the right. I don't mind Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan is. I don't. I don't agree not, with everything Joe Rogan says, but at least he lets people talk. Exactly. Yeah. Right. But Joe Rogan doesn't classify as right or left. Yeah, he, he no. just talks to people. Like, so. He just talks to, he used to be a Bernie various bro. different people from different sections. Yeah, so I like, that's like, why I don't mind. He likes to have conversation, which yeah. is what we do. Yeah. I love that Tom likes to start conversations. Mm. That's what his music does. He start, He says a line, and we've been fucking talking for almost an hour. Yeah, like, bro, Tom, chill. It's too late now. Let <laughs> me... I mean, I mean, that's easy to see. A mask became a symbol of which side you believe. But you'll never cure a sickness till you cure the greed. Because the problem with our natural right immunity there. is it's free. So exactly. Problem with our natural. You'll never, you'll never solve a disease until you solve the greed. Uh, because the problem is our natural immunity is free. Mm-hmm. Pretty much, we don't need. Re replay the line until you get it, Ian. You, you don't need the vaccines or. Anything. Cure a sickness till you cure the greed because the problem with our natural immunity is it's free. Society oh, he said immunity. I didn't hear the yeah, word he yeah. said. Our natural. Go see what he means. Yeah, I, I, I didn't hear. Sickness till you, 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 you cure the, the greed, greed because the problem with our natural immunity is it's free. Okay, that that the immunity is what you I got. You can't cure on. the sickness until you cure the greed because our natural immunity is free. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay. That, I, just, I just didn't hear the... I got lost in the verse. Because if they actually cared about curing anything, cancer would be gone. AIDS would have been gone a long time ago. I mean, we got rid of uh, smallpox. Polio gone, isn't it? Pretty much. I think only times it's coming back are people who actually aren't getting vaccinated yeah. by, by, by an actual vaccine. A vaccine is supposed to be something that stops transmission and it gets us you attacked. Did you, by the way, did you see what uh, the Pfizer executive said the other day? No. When they were asked in Congress, I think, or Parliament, I think it was a Parliament in England, if uh, they knew what the FSC key was when they were telling everybody that it was 95% effective. She laughed and said, of course not. We had to move at the speed of science. Mm. Oh, man. So much to consider. I got to find that clip for you after. So much Dude, to consider. She laughs and says, of course not. We had to move at the lightest of the speed of science. They had no clue what their efficacy was. How effective the vaccine was. They lied. Hmm. Mm -hmm. They told everybody that it was 94% and higher to force as many people as possible to go get it. Mm -hmm. 
this list. <laughs> Oh no! Now people—they probably have complications. They probably have things going on with them that they didn't have before. Hmm. Oh, and with the AIDS and the cancer thing, I'm sure they probably do have freaking uh, cure for that. But you know what? This is what they want. If you have enough money, yeah. Yeah. This yeah. is what they want. If you fucking society is your fucking Magic Johnson. <laughs> Oh yeah, you got curious. You got the money though. That's why. Yeah. So that that that, that there you go. That's proof right you know there. How many poor people have died from AIDS. It is all about the money. Who cares about people? That, that... If they actually cared, insulin in this country wouldn't be the price that it is. No, that's true. Mm -hmm. Good God. Insulin. Yeah. Wouldn't be anywhere near the price. People shouldn't have to rationalize their insulin. People that no. There's so many people with diabetes. People should not have to rationalize That should be that. one of the cheapest medicines. It, it should. It should. You shouldn't have to rationalize that. People should not have to choose between the electricity bill and insulin. Right. That's ridiculous. That's absolutely ridiculous. Drug prices in this country shouldn't be three times the price that they are in other countries. Like, that. That. that's absolutely ridiculous. It's to you. It's because the pharmaceutical companies see us as cash cows. That, oh, they're Americans. They can afford it. Yeah, not everyone. Yeah, not every American can. Yeah, no. But not only that, it, it's the uh, when you get uh, subscriptions from um, the doctors, um, the side effects that that has. Well, most of them are worse than what you actually have. Exactly. That's because a lot of these doctors are just well, back especially back a few years ago, were just pushing pills to mm. push. Yeah. When you could actually go out there, it, I mean, it takes longer and it's a harder work, but you could go out, actually out there and get the remedies that you need from natural plants and stuff like that that could actually heal you. you but you need to do your own research on that and make sure that it actually can be. You can't just, just don't go take any random. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. No, that's what I'm saying. Don't gonna walk say into any you. local health store and let them tell you, this is going to cure you. That's not what we're saying. No. No. no, no Always no, talk no. to a doctor and take what is best yes. for you. And talk we're to not medical yeah. professionals yeah. here. No, exactly. Always talk to a medical professional before making right. any decision. Right. Have to, but have to but, say but yeah. imagine back then how the way they took care of each other, how, how the way they took care of themselves when they didn't have none of that stuff. When they lived to about 36 years old? Yeah. <laughs> no, I said like, <laughs> no, I'm saying like the, like the primitive times. <laughs> A mask became a symbol of which side you believe But you'll never cure a sickness till you cure the greed Because the problem with our natural immunity is it's free Society is broken, want you locked inside a cubicle Addicted to pornography, liquor, and pharmaceuticals <clears throat> Tell you that you're fat and poor and you were never beautiful Then tweet how much they love you when they hear about your funeral Oh! 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 oh, oh, oh. about to... Oh, damn! That's that fake love, bro. Yeah. Bro, honestly, I'm kind of don't wait till I'm dead to give me my roses, bro. Yep. If you if you're going to love love me while I'm here. Don't get me wrong. I'll appreciate people people's remembrance and people's um compassion. Mm -hmm. Don't get me wrong. Anybody would. But you want to know that people have compassion. That's what I'm saying. That people don't like wait you. till I'm in the freaking box and show are, that you cared that about somebody. I appreciate you while you were Nah, don't. That goes for any. Don't wait till somebody's dead to show that that you cared about them, because that just shows you never gave a shit. And, and make sure you know something about somebody. Before yeah, you, man, I was a huge fan. Like, don't be faking your love for people, man. You by race, religion, income, and sex, man. Yup. If they can't convince you, they confuse you. Oh, you know. Both sides. They want you confused and fighting. Mm. So that way you don't hurt or help either side. If mm. you're not, if you're not going to contribute to either one of them, they'd rather you contribute to neither. Yeah, don't tell me I need to pick a side. 
Made everybody right and left. The hatred got so intense. If the other side likes oxygen, you'll put a bag on your head. And the conspiracy theories labeled as misinformation is just a terrifying truth that scares the hell out of the nation. The system treating you like trash and you got rifles to aim with. Just imagine how they'll treat you when your guns get confiscated. George Orwell, 1984 was his last lecture. George called him thought police. Now we call him fact checkers. Government surveillance trying to catch you. They don't ask questions. Mass incarceration equals capital for cash investors. The system isn't broke. It's working fine. Oppressed and chaotic is how it was designed They say if we ain't doing nothing wrong There's nothing to hide While their agenda and intelligence completely classified They don't mm. teach you right mm -hmm. Just because I want Privacy and I don't want Every second of my life On video Doesn't mean I have something to hide I don't need to have somebody watching every second of my life. I'm trying to say, think of how I could say this within the algorithm. No, because you, uh, you need to have your... Everybody is entitled to have their privacy. In other words, mind your... <laughs> Business. <laughs> Three words. It's look. Oh, not two words. Not not two words. <sighs> not two words. Not, not two words. Actually, three. What do you mean? You didn't. You see when Joe Biden said, "I got two words for you." Oh God. Listen, listen, listen. You see, right? Everyone, everyone, take a, take a minute. Take a minute. Take a inhale, exhale. Minding your business is as easy as breathing in air to your lungs. It's not hard to do. You don't have the right to other people's lives. I don't care whether you paid for an artist's album, whether you paid to go see a, a, an athlete perform at a game. Whether you voted for him. Whether, whether you mm -hmm. voted, whatever. You do not have the right to someone's personal life. If they choose to show it to you, that is their consenting choice to do. Other than that, back the hell up. Just like Upchurch. On a Tuesday? Back to, stop telling people how to raise their kids. Stop telling people who they should or not should um should and shouldn't date. Stop telling people what religious beliefs to have. Mind your damn business. It's not hard. It's it's not hard. It's very simple to do. You can be observant. You can be observant. If you don't like something, you don't vibe with it. Walk the other way. Mm -hmm. You don't have to make it known. You don't. Have, and, and 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 everybody who's like, oh well. Everyone should be loved. Not everybody in this world is gonna love you. Get over that shit. Okay? Not get, get over that. Guess what? Not each and every single one of us are special. Like you, you life isn't a whole kumbaya sing by the fire, hold hands and shit. That's not find your people in life that you vibe with and you'll be good. Because guess what? You might not be special, but to somebody you will be like, special. Like, damn. Stop being, Stop getting mad when someone doesn't like the way, like, someone doesn't like the way, okay, doesn't like the way you live. If they don't like the way you live, kick rocks. Just, just let them be. Just because somebody says something you disagree with doesn't mean the sun's not going to come up to Good me. freaking Lord, bro. Y'all kill me with that, oh, I got to know everything. I got to be, no. No, you don't. Quit being nosy. Mind your damn business. Yeah, I know everything, but you know you don't because... Guess what, what happened to the curiosity cat? Yeah. What happened to the curious cat? Last time I checked, the cat got killed. Yeah. Mind your damn business. Get your nose out of everybody else's situation. Because you now, wouldn't want people to know certain uh, yeah. things about you. Or now, well, again, that, like, quit trying to expose people's personal shit. Yeah, exactly. Now, if you observe it. If you see something going on that's illegal, obviously. Yes. But that doesn't mean go looking for it. Yes. Unless yes. you know, if somebody's not giving the signs, doesn't mean, yeah, I bet there's something going on behind there. There's a, there's a clear distinction between reporting something going wrong and snitching. There's a clear freaking distinction. Big difference. Y'all need to learn what snitching is. So many people think... That just because you're reporting a crime that you're snitching. Us. That's no, 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 that's no, not no. what snitching is. No, snitching is when you're involved well, in the crime. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then you tell on somebody it's else. Save your own ass. Exactly. exactly. That's when you snitch. Exactly. That's when you're snitching. When you're on a train and you see a woman getting raped and you call the cops, you're not snitching. <laughs> no, you're doing the right thing. 
Unlike the people, stop in waiting for the next bystander to do something. This Unlike is, the people in Pennsylvania, this is why they're doing. Oh, why you? Why are you trying some shit I don't know about, Vito? They watched. <laughs> they watched and videotaped a woman being raped on a train. Yeah, she's just standing there. Oh, y'all need. I'm like, what the? Honestly, if I would have seen that happen to me as a woman, I would have gone in there. I honestly, I'd arrest you for ass. that shit. Because if you attack the criminal, they're attacking the people who went after the criminal. They're arresting the people that would have attacked the criminal. So people what are too afraid fuck? to do anything now, what Ian. The fuck? People are too nah, afraid to do if anything. I, see that, I wouldn't have cared. I'm, if I'm I know you wouldn't. That, I'm sure that people wouldn't. If I'm seeing no, that shit, nine one one, there's a woman being assaulted over here. Get, mm -hmm. hurry it up. Don't take your sweet ass time. Hurry it up. It's a school you Send never somebody, bro. Because they're easy to remove if you don't know what they are. The only people you can rule are the criminal ones. So they force you into corners till you're breaking the law. Mm. We can't be. The only people they can control Damn. are the criminal ones, so they force you into a corner until you break the law. Damn, this is going to be the longest mm -hmm. Tom McDonald react we ever freaking done. Because he's got a point there. The, only, the only way they can control you is if they can take things away from you by criminalizing you. So how do they criminalize you when they make every little thing a crime? Mm -hmm. Good Lord. Be free. Can't have no peace till we're on the same team. We made it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we guys, we, we freaking made it. Look, look, we made it. End of the video. Now, y'all, I'm looking at the timestamp. No. This is an hour and seven minutes. A hundred percent. If you have to scroll, we understand. We get it. <laughs> we we a hundred percent get it, my man. Guys, no, no, no. I mean, a hundred percent what he said. Oh yeah, yeah. No, no, for real, no. Hundred percent agree with everything he said. A hundred percent. Yeah, just you know. Someone had said. Be mindful of your shit. You know what I'm saying. Like, Oh, you gotta be your your yourself. Like you can't. Ugh. This this is what gets me. Be you. Th like what you want. Like what you want to be. What you if y'all do. don't follow other people just yeah, to be popular or just because that's the trend or just whatever. No, fuck that shit. Amen. Be you. Amen. Be you. Don't. Be and I'm you. sorry. Be. You have to be anybody who exposes anybody issues with like their sexuality or relationship. You're lame as shit. Leave people's, leave people's personal crap alone, man. You're lame. Yeah. You're lame for that. My, whatever someone is doing consensually behind closed doors got nothing to do with you. And in the same token, you don't have to throw your sexuality in anybody's face. Yeah, you don't have to do that. You don't no. got to be doing that. You nobody, don't have to do nobody that. Nobody cares what you do behind no, Close because doors. the thing, the sad part is, is sometimes, and it's not, it's it's probably how the way they were surrounded and stuff like that, is certain people, but they think that by throwing this sexuality out there, that they that that's they're gonna get more more likes, or the people are gonna like them more, or mm -hmm. be interested and in more into them when it's not really like like that. They actually will be putting it down. Mm -hmm. Damn, I get it. Damn, Damn, man, we made it though. We did. We made it. We'll be waiting for all the people who hate us. <laughs> I'm sure there's going to be plenty of people. Oh, uh, okay. When was the music going to be played? Yeah. yeah. At some point it was. Uh, like I said before. There was a song in there. Watch it first. Um, yeah, go, please, and then come please, to please, us. Please, God, go watch the song. Go listen to the actual track first. Yeah. Don't, don't, yeah, yeah. don't. Again. Don't. If you came here. Oh, God. To watch. Don't music. do that. Don't do that to yourself. Don't, don't do that to yourself. That's, 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 that's not smart, y'all. No, no, no. That's not, that's not critical thinking. <laughs> that's not critical thinking. That's what I'm saying. Because we, we detail everything. Yes. We detail it. Okay. Yeah, we're not okay. going to be, we're not going to sit here and be like, oh, yeah, no, it's true what you say. Oh, and then man. go ahead and play. All right. Well, no. Ian, we got to go right into the script. Yeah. So, yeah, we got to get the next, we got to, we got to go work on the next we gotta script. We got to make sure the next one. Yeah, you got to work on my script, man. Yeah, we got to work on this. We got to, we got to, we got to, we got to write Liz. We got to, we got to, we got to write, she didn't write her in and off. We got to write Liz's. We'll, we'll get her a big, we'll get her a bigger part. Yeah, we got to get, so, I want a bigger part. So for y'all, we're going to go work on the script. Um, 
And hey, we'll, we'll see y'all in the next one. Hey guys, week. hope y'all enjoyed this one. Like, comment, subscribe, blow us up. Y'all know what to do. Thanks Appreciate y'all. Thanks for the time with us. Y'all guys take care. See you on the next one. Later. Peace, y'all.